Peter Herbert's gallery. He is the curator of this gallery. It's fabulous. I mean, the range of artworks, mixed media, and it's going to be absolutely thrilling once the show starts. one of the best annual exhibitions um, and it's always a great opening night as well. things that I like about Loudest Whispers is that it is open not just to professional or trained artists but also to what they call um, self-taught or outsider artists so you get a real mix and there is that sense then of inclusivity about it. It's very supportive of the LGB community, but it's a funny thing. It's like we're going to have uh, International Women's Day coming up soon. Why do we need a day all to ourselves? Why do LGBTQ people need a day all to themselves? Well, or or a show all to themselves? Well, obviously we need to raise awareness about these people, and they are just people. And the people in this show are very, very, very talented people. And some of them are making big statements about. LGBTQ. Um, others are just making fabulous art. Is this your first time? Yes, it is my first time. Yes, it is. Yes. Were you a bit uh, overwhelming, like when you first walked in, or were you uh, expecting to see all these fashionable costumes and whatnot? Oh no, I was not expecting to see that. My God, it's been amazing. I was not expecting to see that mask, the costumes. They were amazing, the designers, and a lot of uh, famous. Uh, I mean, a lot of celebrities. Wow. <laughs> it seems as though every year there's more work here, um, and this year it almost seems as the walls are bursting really because there's so many pictures on them but I think that's you know kind of it good really that it shows that lots more people are actually wanting to be involved and so it's built up over the years certainly. I was told that uh, you were uh, given a pill or something to uh, change your gay views or something like that. Yeah. What did you think of that? Um, I, I went to a doctor who tried to ungay me which was great. I'm now straight so that has worked. No it was um, I paid 1200 rupees for, I think, a bit of herbal medicine, right. and it was meant to cure me. And did it? Uh, I'm, I can safely say it did it, man. I mean, I'm quite disappointed, actually. 1,200 rupees, that's quite a lot of money, you know? What motivated you to bring your work down to this, uh, this gallery? I met Peter last year, and, and I went to see this exhibition a few years ago, Loudest Whispers. It was really wonderful. Uh, and I wanted to be part of it. Is this uh, event, uh, do you think it's trying to give out the, the non supporters of LGBT? Uh, what kind of message are you hoping this will get across? Oh, I want it to be saying to everyone that we're a community and we're all in this together and look how diverse we are, look how very varied. And it's just wonderful that Camden Forum is doing all this. Thank you, Camden Forum. Oh!